Hi, it's Chase Harrison here to talk about the next Daily Drumming Influences Revisited, originally posted in 2012. Today it is Graham Lear. If you're not sure who that is, go back and listen to uh, some Gino Benelli from the 70s, uh, specifically the album Storm at Sunup, one of my favorite Gino Benelli albums, by the way. Uh, the tune Where Am I Going? Uh, what a great performance on that. Also, uh, he played with Santana and... Uh, various little other projects and stuff like that, but mostly probably well known for being uh, with Gino Benelli and with Santana. Uh, incredible drummer, probably uh, kind of flew under the radar of a lot of people unless you specifically listen to some of the stuff he did with that. And it's, it's a fairly cool, progressive, if you want to call it that. Um, again, my, my favorite album, or one of my favorite albums by Gino Benelli, The Storm at Sunup, and... Uh, the tune, specifically, Where Am I Going? Uh, such cool drumming on that. And uh, again, Graham Lear, I believe he was a, a Canadian, but I think that he had settled up in the Portland, Oregon area, if I'm not mistaken. I could be mistaken on that. but um, And was he eventually maybe even teaching in that area or something like that. But uh, somebody who uh, certainly goes unsung, who should be praised a lot more, uh, definite influence on me as I try to cop or learn some of the uh, the uh, grooves and the fills and stuff that he did with Gino Vanelli specifically. So just because of that alone uh, and the amount of times that I played the album Storm at Sun and tried to cop things, uh, it was definitely an influence on me trying to learn that. So short and sweet today, the, uh, the drummer... Uh, influential drummer of the day, uh, Graham Lear, again, from Gino Benelli and Santana and many others, but those two specifically. Thanks.